Hi guys, this is Jeff Spalding with WebsitesFreeAndEasy.com and today we're going to work on making simple logos using GIMP. To start off, we're going to create a new project. Go to File, New. Select the template size 640 by 480. Select OK. Choose your text in the toolbox to the left click on your project and type in your text I'm going to size this down And we're going to change the font. Websites are free and easy. And basically, to create a simple logo, it could be the name of your website and then something easy like a a circle or some lines we're going to work with a couple different options here we're going to start by creating a new layer so go to layer new layer we're going to call this design select ok and so now with, with just run our new layer we're going to try a couple different things and in a couple different looks. We're going to select our ellipse tool and create a circle around web. Make that a little smaller. Go to bucket fill, select any color that you would like. We're going to go with uh, blue, select OK, and then click inside of your ellipse circle. Go to your toolbox to the left and go down to the very bottom, and there will be two arrows one pointing up, one pointing down and it'll say lower this layer go to select none and there's a extremely simple logo for your website or or if you just want to use it for plain text to make it look uh, a little cooler, a little nicer and this works other things you can do is go to your pencil. Well, first we're going to select a new layer. Select your pencil tool. And we're going to go to the channels, paths, and brushes over to the right. And select the smallest pencil. So you're going to left click, hold the shift button, and it adds a line under your text. I'm going to go to edit, undo pencil and I want to show you something that comes in very handy is your measurement tool and you can just go up to the top and select this 
and you'll move this down and, and place it here. And this will make sure it, all your lines are straight and you can, if you go to the left, you can do this again. And so now we can go to our pencil tool, left click, hold this shift, left click again, move your layers, I mean your measurement tool, and this will make sure that you have a nice straight line. You can do this as many times as you want or be as creative as you want but to make sure that these line up correctly. Use our measurement tool again. Other our pencil. Hold the shift. the pencil again and we'll move these out of the way and there you go you have double lines you can take the lines off you, these are just some different ideas and some little tricks you can use to create your own simple and easy logos for your websites thanks for watching you can uh, check out websites freeandeasy.com for more video tutorials. Thanks and have a great day.